Junction Condos House of Assembly. Today we're going to look at the new condos at Toronto Junction area, especially the House of Assembly. Hello everyone, Yossi Kaplan here, Toronto Real Estate Agent Mortgage Broker with Search Realty and Search Mortgage. I want to talk to you about the Junction. I talked about the Junction before in the last two years. The Junction made a huge step towards becoming a real neighborhood. Uh, what you're looking here is a render that includes, uh, if you can see my mouse here, this is the automotive building that exists for many, many years, and it became um, the museum, the MoCA Museum of uh, Contemporary Art. And this is here across the street. Uh, right now, there's nothing there, just a parking lot. That is going to be the first building launched called House of Assembly. And it's the first uh, building for Marley Spr Marling Springs developer who is developing this entire area. And this entire area uh, is sitting in that little triangle here. Um, it's going to have some office building. It's going to have three residential buildings, and it's a master plan community. So in my opinion, the people going to buy here are going to be less investors and more end users. I'm going to say that one more time because it's really expensive, really, <laughs> really important. Uh, the people are going to live here are going to be, in my opinion, more end users and less investors. Why is it important? Because we see in each and every project, there's more end users. The values are going up and up and up because people move less. If you buy a unit and you live there, you don't tend to move as quickly as you would move if you're renting. When you rent, you just pack up your stuff and go to the next place. Uh, when, you, when you're buying, it's not like that, and usually you're more settled in your life. And that means that there are less units available at any given time to rent or to own. If someone's putting their units up for rental or, or, to, or to sell them, and that means that the proper prices and the future prices of these units, uh, either for rent or to own, is being pushed up, okay? Now, what I like about master plan communities is they're massively planned. They really look at everything and they go, okay, where, where are these people going to live? They look at the traffic. They look at the life needs. They look at, you know, where's the doctor? Where's the school? Where do you get your food? Where's traffic? Uh, where is public transportation? How you get there with the bicycle? Where do you park? And they, they try to put it all into a plan, and then they send this plan to the city of Toronto, of course, who needs to approve it, okay? And that's what I like. So you can see here, that's a very good spot. Uh, there's another one. This is the actual building. This is the House of Assembly. On the left here is the old automotive building, which is now called the Museum of Contemporary Art of Toronto, the MOCA, used to be on Queen West. So that is the building, okay? Um, Another thing I want to show you here. Got some. Okay, so here's the view. This is the cross the street, the automotive with the building wrapping. It looks pretty nice and modern to me. Uh, here's another angle from the other side. That's across the street, okay? Um, here's another angle. Kind of give you an idea of if you are actually the house assembly looking across the street, uh, you will see this building if you're looking. Um, to this way, which I believe would be this is the west view, okay, and that's the whole community. Some townhouses coming in there, and this is the whole section. You can see the Sterling Junction, <laughs> uh, Sterling Road uh, Junction. There's also a chocolate factory there. It's uh, I think the Kit Kat uh, Hershey's, so it smells like chocolate there. It's really nice if you like that smell. Uh, fantastic area, you know. Junction is coming up real fast. Uh, the up which will have a stop at Liberty Village is there. The TTC is there. Uh, you're well positioned. There's a Loblaws. There's all the big stores. There's a Shoppers. I think there's a Freshco, one of those two. Okay, so here you can see another view, another render. Okay, some renders of the building. This from Condo Now. You can actually see a view here of the area that Marling Spring is developing. Okay. Uh, the subject site, this is where the building is. This is across the street, the automotive and everything that comes with it. Uh, here's the map so you can see where you are, okay? And again, we're talking about the junction, condos by Marling Spring, phase one, house of assembly. In my opinion, I think you should take a look at this. I have the information. Contact me for any more information. I think this could be a very, very, very good opportunity for people who want something more personalized, uh, less huge, more artistic, more lifestyle, okay? So this entire area I'm showing you here will be developed properly. Okay, friends, that's all for today. Uh, give me a shout. This project is launching any day. Maybe by the time you watch it, it's already launched. Junction Condos, House of Assembly, Yossi Kaplan. Thank you. See you in the next video.